see. All right, all right. I passed up a pile of stuff. It looked like a legit pile of stuff, too. Uh-huh. That's a legit pile of scrap. Really cool Schwinn Stingray in there. Oh. Y'all got some uh, like scrap metal, like metal stuff. Hold on, like metal. Oh no, I'm picking up scrap metal. Yeah, yeah, all right. Thank you, though. Uh, all right. Actually, my yard won't take these. Sweetness. Yep, no. Oh, all right, I passed up a little aluminum, little shower chair. Actually, these are highly resellable. These guys right here, it's a great shape too. Heck, I might put it in the shower for me. Let's see here. Pretty bad shape. Any money? Any money? Okay, let's see. Ooh, look at that. There goes some copper. Take the copper, man. Uh, all day long, son. It pays to get in there. Oh. All right, kiddo. Oh, this is Atari 800. Hold up. Atari 800. Dude, something tells me that's old. We'll have to, definitely have to look that up. Atari 800, holy cow. I don't even remember that. It's a cute little cutting board. All right. Sweet. All right, y'all, there goes a metal headboard. Can you call it a metal headboard? Or a headboard, because it's not a board. Either way, you're coming aboard my ship. <laughs> board <laughs> all right y'all check it out it's a stove and stuff let's get it smash just kidding i don't do that right, what's it say it says take me scrap junk metal okay <laughs> you got it uh, scrap junk metal Oh, hold on, she got water on her. Yeah, we had a little bit of rain. Actually, we had quite a bit of rain. <sighs> April showers, bring May flowers. All right, y'all ready to be strong? Let's do it. Yes, stove with your stuff. Sweet. Money in the bank, bro. <sighs> well, all right, y'all. Uh, I already ran into a couple of scrappers out here. Scavengers. 
driving around picking up stuff i mean times are tough i get it so uh we got a couple of things i think we got some pretty good stuff actually but uh let's go hit up some dumpsters and we'll put the cherry on the whipped cream oh i'm going this way let's go get it Take this hey. Ooh, what we got? Oh, that looks like coax. Those overturned boxes back there got my attention. Let's go check them out. Ugh. Let's see here. Yeah, that's coaxial cable. <coughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's a lot of coax in there. There's some. All that that is. Oh, bummer, bro. Let's see here. We'll go through it. There's there's a little bit of copper in there that you can throw. We'll take that to shred, Paul. Comcast Business Services. Let's see. I ain't taking that to pull. Whoa there, whoa! Whoa! Probably pop the end off, make it a little bit easier. But hey, we're almost there. Man, I thought that was extension cord. Bummer, bro. Right. Shove it in our box of stuff. Okie dokie, smoky. It looks like it. We'll have to be, we'll be back because I've been coming by here. They had the big open top a while back and now it's gone and then they're, they're getting all their stuff and stuff in place. So maybe we'll have some snippets. Oh. Well, there's a little cat wire. Oh, my back! Ah. Ooh. All right, we got wires. These better wires. <sighs> That's some cat wire. Little pieces. Cat 5E. <sighs> Little bitty pieces. Ooh, just dumped her. Ah. Let's see. I see more wires. Well, let's do what we do best. Dive on in. Oh yeah, there's some wires. Grab them suckers. Hey, snip his head up. Look at that. There's a screwdriver. Somebody forgot their screwdriver. Fine now. Uh, 
any cameras in these boxes that would be pretty cool although that ain't not very likely with the old cameras if they were replacing old cameras they may not have been replacing old cameras Why rage and thirst? Look at that, there's a whole bottle of water. Anyway. All right, y'all. On to the new, 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 new. It's starting to kind of get misty, drizzly out here tonight. But, uh, you know, here on Mike the Scavenger's block, we, we try to do what we can, rain or shine, you know. We love our fans and just want to make it happen for you guys. Oh, bro, what we got up in here? Oh, is that a... Is that a green machine? Oh, I've always wanted a green machine. It sure is. It's falling apart, though. I am no, I'm fixing this sucker up. Come on, green machine. Although living in Southeast Houston kind of sucks when it comes to, you know. Oh. The steering still works. But we don't have no hills. I mean, I guess I could roll down the, uh, the Beltway 8 bridge. But I don't think I'd be able to keep up with traffic. Let's see. A little bit of scrap. Oh, look at that fan. There's a cooler. All kinds of stuff in here, y'all. I ain't even messing with that cooler because there was like bugs. I can see like right around the edge of it. Let me see. I'm probably gonna regret this. I can't, I just see a bunch of water ball and just, oh, it stinks. Dude, I got a green machine. I'm gonna fix that thing up. I saw that they put like a big PVC. They get, you know, like big, big 12, 13, 14 inch PVC pipe and they just cut it and they just go around the wheels. But then again, I, like I said, I ain't got no hills, man. Oh. Y'all let me come out to Cali. I wanna come out to Cali. Oh. Oh. Somewhere with some hills. Holy shoot. All right, fan scrap. Oh, man. Hold. I ain't touching that cooler. Oh, I think I see something. Some of these bags. I think I see, like, there's some... Some cookware. My cooler. That's an Arctic. Is that an Arctic cooler? Oh, it's already tearing apart. Oh, Arctic, get it together, man. Oh, God. I think I saw a little bit of, oh yeah. Oh man, we gotta get in. All right, y'all are my alibi. I did everything that I could to not get in. And here we are, getting in. But I saw a big, a big old, big old pot. I'm not gonna pass up on a big old pot. There's another husky tool bag. I 
I don't know, it kind of makes you wonder. Why is everybody keeping on with their Tusky Hole? Tusky Hole bag. Their Husky Tool bag. A little bit stainless. Ooh. Shh. Shh. It's a boo boo flashlight. Super boo boo. I'll take that container though. Nope. <sighs> yep. Yep. Oh yeah, that's affirmative. And then we got a bunch of boo-boo belts. Yeah. It's okay. Ooh, that's some gross grossness. You gotta love rain, but you gotta hate it. Yeah, I'm gonna. I do not want that nasty mold covered. Cooler and Arctic, get it together, man. Get it together, bro. Let's get up out of here. My finger. Charlie. My finger. Oh. Alright, we got some stuff. Whoa! Whoa! Dude, that's what I talk about coming in hot. Ooh, what we got here? I see a few things. How wet is it in here? Okay, we could probably get in. Just got to be a little bit careful. Oh. Say that's some cheap old furniture right there. Holy cow. That's what I mean when I say they don't make them like these. Look at this, dude. Got a bunch of uh, sink stuff. Some brass. Well, I bet that's copper too. Those aren't too too shabby. Look, like somebody re-outfitted their whole house. Uh, that's all right. I'll take it. I'll take it. See how it's like changing colors. I bet that's I bet that's brass. Uh, whoa! There goes a lantern. Definitely not from the uh, days of the. Uh, Gold mines. It has a, uh... Dude, that's crap. Alright. It's kind of heavy. What that is? We'll grab it anyway. How about that? There goes a shower head. Yeah, somebody like re-outfitted their whole house. Oh, that's pretty heavy. The heck? Ultra Track. Oh, that must be like a... Uh, like one of those rowing machines. Believe it or not, folks. Those are the rowing machines? They will get you in shape. There goes some speakers. Some Harley parts. Huh. Yeah, my pop said when, uh, when he was a kid, he lived up there in uh, New Hampshire. Oh, they had like a pond. 
And he said he'd grow every day. And he said at the end of the summer when he was there, he came out looking. Oh, dude. what is all this? Ugh. Looks like this is mostly. Ooh, I see the pesticide, chemicals. Good thing it didn't break. All right, that looks like the other part of the ultra track. Well, let's grab it all just to make sure that, you know, because I mean, we can end up scrapping it out. That's the lowest form of what it's worth. There goes some aluminum uh, breakage right there. All right. Oh, what's the bike? What's the bike? I think that's the seat for the thing. <sighs> you got a little bit there. Dad, there's even some face plates. Those are pretty nice. Oh, there's a lot of glass in there. Watch out for the glass, y'all. Yeah, that's all broken glass. I'm not a fan of broken glass. Put this over here. And then that thing is over here. I mean, it's got the Harley logo. I mean, there's two of them. I'm not sure what those are. We'll grab them though. We will grab them. Because at the very least, if it's nothing, well, you know, it's nothing. Look at that. Oh, it's a bunch of shit. Whoa, sticks. This stick just took that right here. Oh, man. Dude, this dumpster is like rocking. There goes a safe. There goes an escort. It feels like there's something in there. Got the safe. Who's got the key to the safe? I mean the Jeep. All right, we got a stick. Oh. Yeah, I'm watching out for that water, y'all. That's no good. There goes the basket. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Get our box of stuff. Oh. All right, y'all. Got a lid. Let me get out of here. And no, y'all, I don't do crystal meth. Somebody said a lick. It was like something they heard from meth addicts. Like, no, bro. Just a dude trying to make a few bucks. Mm. A few extra bucks. Okay, hold on. Jeez. Oh, Let's see what happened here. It lost the thing. Shoot. I don't know, I still probably get a buck on it. Hi everybody, what's happening up in here? Oh death. Death boo-boo and stuff. Oh. <sighs> little peace. Get your peace. Peace. Like a salsa. 
Oh, it's so heavy. Why are you so heavy? Hey, that looks an open. Prof hanger strip. Now oh, there's all kinds of crap in this box. All right. We'll go through that in the morning. Oh man, the watermelon though. The watermelon. Ooh, that. Just stuff in the packaging still. It's that lower thermostat. Part numbers, we'll look it up. Or actually, it looks like it may be missing something. I don't know. I'll set it over here. I won't pilfer through it over a cup of coffee in the morning. Hello. Oh, hold on. Wait a minute. There's another box back there. Oh. oh. <sighs> okay, it's an open too. All right. But the cerveza es no más. <laughs> pictures well we got some pictures of uh, it looks like a woman loving her car uh, yeah that's oh hey, hey. dripping water bro get on my mm. Woo, yeah baby check that out there goes a pooter just one, one here. Oh. Oh, it's got all the stuff in it. Yeah, it's pretty heavy too. Let's see. Oh man, that hurts so much right there. Hold up, let me get a box. Do a little improvisions. All right, there we go. Mucho más, mucho más. It's a Dell. Oh, I think I had that thing off. Yeah, there we go. The power supply. The fan. Oh no, there it is. There's the hard drive right there. Duh. Actually, it's got room for. Golly, you could probably put two, two hard drives in that thing. A Dell N305P-06. Huh? Sweetness. It looks pretty legit too. Any more of those? Well, let me go get my stick. My stick. Just to double check. Under all this stuff, just in case. I mean, we just. I mean, we did just find a computer. I mean, what if we found another computer? I mean. It's unlikely, but you never know. You never know. <sighs> yeah, I'm going to say probably not. All right, y'all. Let's go find some more stuff. Safe. <sighs> well, it looks like we got some parts to an AC or something. These are the ones that'll 
It'll cut you in half. So we might as well go ahead and get on in. Got some wires. Cat wire. box here. A little blower. A little blower that don't blow no more. Some wire. Y'all right. gotta be careful with this uh this AC stuff. Basically any appliance when you start getting into the panels and stuff, these edges right here, they haven't been like smoothed over, you know, like the uh, sharp edges have not been broken. <sighs> but they say in the drafting will uh, break all sharp edges. <sighs> and, uh, oh, they'll get you. They'll slice you, they'll dice you. They'll call your mom too and be like, yo, that hurts, mom. Yeah, that's probably stainless hose right there. There's a little piece of copper too. Man, we're just getting all, all kinds of lucky in here, huh? Yeah. Some more wires. Whoa. Holy Alabama, y'all. Roll. Oh, I'm not flexible. All right. Oh, I was born with with small hamstrings, y'all. I got small hammies. All right. Well, good morning, everybody. How we doing? Sweet, sweet. Got the lawnmower guys out there working. Sweet. Ah, uh, where should we start? Um. I guess we can start with this thing, the ultra track. I got the uh, all the stuff. I'm still trying to figure out how it all goes together though. Ugh, but those guys, those little handles, it's some sort of uh, like it's got these rubber bands. It's a resistance dealio. The more you put on, the harder it is. Ugh, so, but I don't know. I'll have to look it up online. It's definitely cheap. Definitely cheap. That's for sure. So if it's missing something or whatever, you know, I'm scrap it out. I uh, got the Atari 800. Uh, kind of looked these up online. Uh, this thing I think is from 79. Is that what it said? Atari manufactured model number Atari 800 462. I think I saw somewhere where there was an, a date of 79. Or maybe that's why I looked it up online. But uh, people still have these that are in working condition and you know, there's two, three hundred dollars, whatever. I, dude, I don't know. I mean, there's supposed to be a monitor or something. Does it plug into a monitor? <sighs> and it's missing some keys. So I could probably sell it for like, uh, what does this do? Parts or repair. Ooh, check that out. It's got a thing in there. Dig Dug computer game. Dig Dug. <sighs> Okay, not sure, not sure. Maybe I can sell that. God, this stuff is so old. Like, doesn't even want to spring back. That's crazy, crazy. Uh, got us a uh, a green machine over here. It's in really bad shape. Tires are all tore up. I've always wanted one. But this thing, I'm not going to lie. It's definitely seen better days. Maybe mess with it. Like I said, we don't have hills and such here to really go down except the uh the freeway bridges but that's probably not a safe thing to do so i don't know what do y'all think try to fix her up is there any resale in it just as it stands you know 10 20 bucks i mean i know these are sought at well i've seen videos of guys going down hills doing 360s and stuff and it looks so much fun so much fun so <coughs> <coughs> 
So y'all let me know on that. Let's see, over here we got some Harley Davidson stuff. I'm not 100% sure what these are. They look like little saddlebags. Like little saddlebags. But there's definitely a left and a right. Got some Harley Davidson speakers here. I don't know if somebody, you know, this was extra and then they like got rid of their bike and then tossed these out. I don't know. But I mean, just by saying Harley Davidson, it's probably worth something. Uh, I still don't know what this is. It's got like a wound up thing in there. It's like a, I don't know, maybe a bell. This, uh, let's see, multi fit live to ride logo timer cover quantity one. It says 30, 28.95, 30 bucks. Is that all it is? Just a cover? Three, two, six, three, eight, dash 11. That says three, two, six, nine, eight. So that may be something. That may be something different right there because the screws look like they definitely not new. So that probably, I don't know, we'll have to look up that number, 3263811. I know a little bit about bikes. I got some buddies that are into the uh, the whole Harley thing. Uh, see, we got some, uh, all these uh, plumbing fixtures over here. We'll see if we can clean these up as best we can for scrap like this right here. Uh, see how I just unscrewed that? It'll give you brass for that. Uh, this is probably gonna be brass too. Uh, there's a screw in there. I don't know. They may, they may give you. Yeah, you got to get that screw out of there. But yeah, that's a solid chunk of brass. Uh, you can cut these pieces off if you want brass. My scrapyard will actually give you a set price for just uh, uh, sink fixtures. It's not much. So if you can clean it up, by all means, definitely clean it up, or resell it for that matter. I mean, these are real pretty. It's like a whole set. <sighs> <laughs> outfit my house i'm renting a house i'd freak the uh homeowner out and they come back and it's like all this new stuff in their house that i found in the trash see this comes off i think is that unscrewing yeah see these look like they could be taken apart see that comes off right there so that's going to be a piece of either brass or aluminum it looks like aluminum yeah you get a hex head in there pull pop this off you know, you can clean these up a little bit, get you a little something, something out of there, or just scrap them out as they are. Uh, little scrap over here, stainless steel pot. It's really dirty. Uh, yeah, you can probably clean it up, get five, 10 bucks for it at a garage sale. Some more garage sale tchotchke stuff. The Escort, because you know, we all need an Escort. Oh, it's not in there. Just the box. Darn, I thought we were gonna get lucky. Oh well, uh, let's see over here. This says cock hole cover, cotch hole, some sort of hole cover. Scrabity scrap. What are these? Ooh, that's copper, I think. Yep, those are little copper fittings. All that right there, number one. All day long, son. That looks like the for an auger and then these can't tell are these open or not they don't look to be open the lower thermostat i'll have to look it up by the part number the packaging is in just terrible shape this one's not as bad yeah it's a part for something it's a factory authorized part that's what it says see some fitting some plastic you know a little this, a little that. Then we got a bunch of crap up in the back. Some scrap, uh, some car parts. Those mufflers back there. Uh, they're all steel. But the tips, the little exhaust tip, you cut those off. That's stainless. And then I think there was some like needle nose pliers. Those long needle nose. I'll check those out. Uh, probably hang on to those for sure. But uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh yeah, over here. What we got over here? Uh, got the shower chair. Put this down here. All right. Yeah, brand new stuff. Yeah, all this stuff's new too. This is a uh, wasted overflow plastic lift and turn chrome plated. Part number Papa Foxtrot Whiskey 0400 in the box. 
And then Electrolux, this is a, uh, it's a water, it's a solenoid valve. It's a quad solenoid valve. A water quad solenoid valve, part number 24225302. It's still new in the box, unopened, we'll take it. Uh, Proflow galvanized hanger strap. Yeah, that's just a, uh, a hanger strap right there for, uh, I guess you would, uh, it's got holes in it. It's just like a big long metal strap with holes in it, I guess for like hanging pipes and stuff along. Up overhead, a little bit of scrap there. This is plastic garçois. What's in here? What, what these are, these are heavy. Whatever that is, it's heavy. Doesn't really say anything on there. Oh, it's just like, uh, what the heck is that? Some plates of some sort. Yeah, just some metal plates. I don't know what they go to. There's no part number, no manufacturer, no nothing. Oh, there's something. 40030. That's all? No manufacturer, no nothing? Oh well. Scrappity scrap oh shizzle. And then the rest of that just looks like junk. Classic junk. Somebody's leftover lunch. Had some Sonic or something. So uh yeah, we got some new stuff. We got some pretty cool stuff. Uh, I want to take a look at this box over here. This Century Safe box we pulled out of the one dumpster. It's got stuff in it. And it shouldn't be hard to pop. Because it is a El Cheaperino. But I'm thinking there's probably nothing real fancy in here. I mean, it's not that nice of a safe. But let's see what we can do here. Pop this sucker open. There we go. She pop right open. Ah. Oh. It's just batteries. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, well. A little scrappity scrap there. But yeah, we got the Dell computer here. Uh, we opened it up. It's got all the guts inside. It's a little bit older. But hey. I'll take it. Well, alrighty, scavengers. That's going to do it for this episode of uh, Urban Treasure Hunting. Uh, appreciate y'all tagging along. As always, it was a total pleasure. Be sure to like the video, subscribe to my channel. Shout out to everybody that bought some merch. Appreciate that. If y'all are interested, down below, Teespring. I saw somebody got a new t shirt with the BMX bike. Appreciate that. Uh, y'all go check it out. Uh, oh, yeah, like the video, subscribe to the channel, share with your friends. Instagram, got one. Go check it out. Alrighty guys, well, I'm gonna get cleaned up, get washed up, get my thing, <sighs> work on some stuff, and then uh, there's no rain in the forecast for tonight, so we'll probably get out there and hit it again. Mm, let's go. What we got here, y'all? Scrappy, scrap, scrap. Ah!